What's good with your boys? It's the Dark Lord, Cubic Lords. I uh, played Cubics over at Houston Regional, so it was pretty good. Like, towards the end of the day, I started, like, getting my bad luck spirit. I don't know. I can't shake that bad luck. But I just started dead drawing. But other than that, the deck was consistent. It's pretty good. Uh, my homeboy let me borrow it. And let's get started. All right, let's go. We get three Doozas. He's your Foolish Burial Goods. He sends your spell cards so you can combo off. And uh, if a monster is sent from field to grave, uh, during the player's turn, you can have him bump up by 200 for each monster in grave with a different name. That actually comes up. Yeah, and it comes up a lot. Like, you get people that link, and you can just bump them up with uh, different names in grave. And then we got your boss, 3000. Oh, this dude, the man, this dude is, oh my God, it breaks boards. And people don't understand how it breaks boards because he can't be targeted or he's unaffected by monsters with uh, tech less than him. So if your monster is 2950, like Draco, like Masterpiece, Piece. you ain't you ain't touching them. The only way you, you get to them with trap cards and not most people like play traps because you got pendulums. But yeah, you got Alter Guys. You get pendulums. Yeah, they, they don't play traps. They don't, they don't play traps. And uh, Gokies, they they sometimes play traps. They'll play like strikes. But you can break their boards pretty easy because their monsters are low. And uh, but you gotta watch out from Ib. If they get a Ib Ibly on your side of the field, it's kind of hard to Probably summon Ibly. them. But this dude won a lot of games for me. I fucks with him. <laughs> sure. uh, we got your three C, your sperm, <laughs> your sperm. sperm. <laughs> uh, we got three V jams. He's good for like in mid game and like when you're trying to stall and get like the certain cards you need to summon him because he's a summoning condition. And uh, these these came in clutch against ABC. I just set and he didn't have any cards to discard. And attacking into it, and I just activated effect after damage step. He can uh, oh, yeah. equip no himself. Monster. Yeah, he equipped himself to the monster. It negates the uh, effect, and it can't uh, attack. And the uh, counter stays on there permanent until he like gets rid of the monster or whatever, or you destroy it. But VJ, the C, you gotta get him. Uh, I run two of these. I I would really want run one. But oh, two is good bad, because of the name. And uh, I guess, uh, let me read this. I forgot what he do. After uh, he battles, you could tribute him and target up to two V gems in uh, Grave and special summon them. And if you got the continuous continuous spell card, Karma. Yeah, you have their life yeah, points. You yeah, you can have their life points, and it's pretty good. It's busted. I did that once. I only resolved it once. I was surprised when I resolved it. The dude's kind of playing a slow deck. Man, it, it was just crazy how diverse the meta was right now. I know. And I seen so many people. Like I, I even seen Gokis just going off on people. I know. Gokis uh, is highly represented today. I played one Bahamut. Uh, he's pretty good uh, when you get him off of the unification. And uh, you have three of Dooza. Engrave, so you could summon up to three, or you could just summon two doozas if you have them engraved. Bro, and three thousand, uh, and he attacking. Three yeah. Times if you summon him the right way. Yeah, if you if you summon him the right way, he can OTK and break boards too. He's pretty busted. He gains thirty four, and he can attack up to three times. It's pretty good, but sometimes we just use him for the destruction effect to special summon from grave. Uh. We got the other one. I, I'm pretty sure I, I forgot how much attack he gains, but 24. 24, and he could attack up to twice, I believe. And, but this card is almost the same concept as this one, so you you just want to let it get destroyed by your opponent's card effects or by battle, or just any kind of way it's sent by your opponent's card effects, and uh, revive your monsters from graves. But man, this deck's crazy. It's pretty nutty. We get one of him, cause you you just want to really, 
run one of those because you don't want to clog it up or try to yeah, run. Yeah, it gets real bricky, so you just run your one of for the names. And uh, I don't really, I haven't drawn this that much. I only drawn it twice throughout all nine rounds. Should have played three, huh? I don't, I just don't like it because the time I did play it, I didn't have a call by the grave in hand and they just ashed it. And I was just like, fuck, there goes my normal summit. <laughs> but it, it didn't matter because I had your boy right here, the true Draco Slayer. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, we got you two kaijus. You got to have kaijus in here sometimes. Uh, I've seen most builds without kaijus, but kaijus, they get over problem cards that you can't just simply resolve. You know what I mean? Y'all understand. Y'all grown. Y'all know how to play this game. <laughs> Y'all grown. Y'all know how to play this game. Yeah. I ain't got a teacher, preacher. Uh, we got your one up start for consistency. We got your fusion conscription. Come, yeah, I said it right. You said it right. <laughs> And then uh, you reveal this, and then you add a copy of whatever you need to fusion him. So basically, you had uh, this big fella here, mm -hmm. Dark Lord. We got uh, Monster Gate. Yeah, yeah you, Monster Gate's dope. Uh, just to go back on this card, after you resolve this card, you can't no more or set, or yeah, you can't no more set cards. So just like normal summon your Dooza, set up your board so you can pitch the trap card. Cause the trap card's the also- works, Whatever you search, you can't use it that time. Yeah. Think of it like you yeah. sold. Yeah, so that's pretty good. Uh, so we got Monster Gate, so you could tribute. Uh, the ones you, you mostly summon off of it will either be your boy right here, summon the monk. This one, Dooza, or uh, VJ. And that's what mostly you'll summon off of Monster Gate. And either one of these help, because obviously you're gonna pitch a spell or you're just gonna send a spell to Grave and then VJ just to block. VJ is too good. Uh, we got one Dark Cole. Dark Cole, it's pretty good. I wanted to run like more kaijus with kaiju slumber, but I just didn't have it. I made the deck at the last minute, thanks to my oh, boy, Three morning. Stacks. Yeah, thanks to my boy, Three Stacks, he came through. I was missing cards out of my cubic deck, but he was like, hey bro, I just got the whole cubic deck, you can borrow it, try oh, to do something with it. This and I was like, dude, I don't even got a full extra deck. That's how bad it was. Uh, no. But I was still still schooling people, dude. I'm talking about trick stars, uh, ABCs, uh, pendulum. I, I beat uh, one, two pendulum people, but I went against four pendulum players today and got OTK twice from two different people. Uh, I played one uh, contract. You pay a thousand, you and your opponent draws a spell card, keep it revealed, and you can't no more special summon until you use that that right. uh or you can special summon you just can't normal summon until you use that spell card and it, it just caught people off guard because some people just don't know what it is you know what i'm saying and it's just good for the 1000 burn because you want to try to get your opponent lower than what you are you know? yeah. the crimson nova for the crimson Infamous. nova exactly uh call to the Call by the grave, not called to the grave. Called by the grave. I wish I had a third one. This put in work. I drew it like 70%. Like I drew it. It, it was pretty good. And it, you already know it stops all the hand traps. Not like hand traps, Bro, but. You used to stop ABCs today. Yeah, and I, I stopped Buster. Like he couldn't do nothing. Uh, also. Let him summon Buster because it's called by the grave. Exactly. Like uh, when they tribute Buster on your standby or main phase to activate effect, you can just chain this, banish it, and they don't even get the summon. And the tributes for cost. So they're stuck with nothing on their field. It's too busted. Uh, three, Foolish Burial of Goods. It's to send your spell and trap cards because that's how you get your combos. You have to mm -hmm. pitch your spell and trap cards in the grave. If you don't do that and you got them all in hand, there's something wrong with you. You just <laughs> not There's something wrong with you. But good thing I didn't break too much. Like I was just amazed how consistent the deck was. 
three twin twisters. I set the uh, trick stars with twin twisters because like I draw two of them before and uh, he just had a full back row and he's like reincarnation. I'm like, okay, chain, uh, discard my continuous spell card. So basically I'm not, here you go, uh, karma. So, ba so basically I'm not losing that much life points and yeah, I'm not drawing that much, but I still get my graveyard set up. You know what I mean? Right. So, so I could, exactly. So I banish this for a doozer and just normal summon doozer and keep it going. Like keep it pushing dogs. It can't hold me. And I also uh, didn't get to play True Dracos, but I was hoping to play True Dracos. Man, you was I didn't ready play. For I was ready for him, man. Uh, we got your Cubic Karma. This your Searcher, your Rota. Best mm -hmm. card, if you ask me. Uh, I resolved this card, uh, like I said, once. Like with the half life points, but I resolved the effect to see, send B Jam like four times, and it was pretty good. I made my dudes a, like, 4,000 and they just was stunned. They was like, okay, I can't do nothing. I can't beat, beat over that monster. And if they get rid of Dooza, I would just bring out another one. But it'll be at 16, but I'll still get my graveyard going. Uh, we got Cubic Wave. This card is amazing. Uh, mm -hmm. It halves your opponent's monster and then it doubles yours. So basically, if you have Big Daddy Kane over here out on the King field, King. Bossing around, you have to, your opponent's monster. Yeah, it's basically game. Like they're gonna scoop. I made a a pendulum person scoop because all he he did was set a he set a fame and pass turn and I summoned Dooza in this and he was like, all right, that's game. Let's go to game two. And I was like, easy, easy. <laughs> I was hoping to go to against Gokis. I really wanted those easy wins. And, uh, like, the Spyro deck is good as fuck with Ibley yeah, in there. Today. Yeah, but they can't really do nothing. If they don't have Ibley on your side to where you can't summon and you're able to get this dude on the field, they're stuck with him. Yeah, you know Spyro's what I'm saying? They, they, got yeah, a they got a Kaiju. They got to go out their way to get rid of this card. It's some is some abnormal stuff, you know what I mean? Some abnormal stuff. <laughs> hey, it's it's three thousand or less. You can't even take him yeah. with the load. You have to attack over. And it says the original, so you can't try to bump your monster up to get over right. him. That's what Masterpiece never does. With exactly. Uh, we got your unification, Dude, your trap soul. Card is just broken. Dude, I just love this trap card. Thank God it wasn't no stupid monster effect to banish, cause called <laughs> by the grave. They, they can't stop it. Uh, you can ash it, but sometimes you can't ash it and damage that because uh, after you battle and destroy a monster by battle, it's still in damage step, basically. I mean, not damage step, but y'all get what I'm saying. And uh, let's start with the extra deck. Like I said, I didn't even have that much extra deck. It's just like random stuff my homeboy right here, Ivan gave me. Straight up doing it for the squad. King of games, baby. Uh, <laughs> We got your Crimson. I only run one for the the conscription. I believe, yeah, I said it right again. Uh, or Boros, in case if I get all three deuces out and my opponent's just struggling with one card. That said, I'm probably afraid of it. Just gotta get rid of it. And or I just wanna discard cards from their hands, get rid of their resources. It's pretty good. Right. Uh, Ebly for your lean, cause all your monsters, they're like different types and different attributes. This is pretty good when you're uh, when you have Dooza and uh, something any other monster out there, you can link and activate your trap card from Grave because they left the field, so that's good for the link play. Uh, we got your Castell, so we can bounce back field spells, face up spell and trap cards, anything that you can target with this card. It's pretty busted. Uh, we got your Babuska, your desperate play. You need a couple turns, set that boy on the field. Walking skill drain, they can't do nothing. They're just gonna be like, damn it, I gotta wait until they make a link. But these days we spam in like crazy. They can't stop us. Uh, we got your proxy dragon. Uh, like Ib Ibly, it's just there, so you can link it yeah, away. And that's summon them on combat. Yeah. And oh yeah, yeah, my boy was telling me, but I'll get to the, I get to that part in a no, minute. I don't got to. I showed them a lot on the channel. All right, that's a bit. Uh, we got your Carrie Gordon. 
2450 for master or yeah true draco decks or anything that targets really get rid of them uh i played this two of these just in case if i have two big dudes on a board and i want to we're down in time and i'm not trying to lose that much life or i just don't want to lose that much life in general because i know they're like a they have a comeback deck i don't know but uh basically you overlay for this dude uh you could detach during either player's turn and he's unaffected by card effects it's and he's four thousand defense three three thirty two hundred attack it's pretty busted right all right uh we got your dread Obviously, y'all know what Dread does. If you link four monsters with different names or types or names, uh, you draw four. And then you place one, three back at the bottom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then your monsters gain 300. Yeah, you can special one for man. Uh, we got your Trishbania to banish okay. spell, and, spell and trap cards on the field. It's good uh, when you're doing your combo against True Draco. And uh, you can banish their spell and trap cards, basically. And uh, yeah, they might pop it, but uh, you you uh, you can summon banish the trap card and summon on on a, a link that it points to. I'm sorry, I'm gonna uh, be just done. It's cool. Bro. Lost in my words. Go I've been up all day. Uh, onto the side deck. Let's get get this shit cracking. We got your forbidden chalice, so you can negate effects or just boost right. your attack. You really want to just negate effects. We got your three Sephion, Sephion? True Dracos and Ultra Time Lord. Yeah, Exactly. True Dracos and Ultra Guys. Shuffle them, spell and drop cards back. We got your one Kaiju. Mm -hmm. I should have I should have got a Kaiju Slumber and put it in a side deck. I regret that. It this morning. Yeah, yeah, but it's all good. Uh, got your three anti-spell fragrance just right. for True Dracos. I didn't draw them even when I sided them. So it just made me just... Yeah. yeah. Uh, we got your three drone lockbirds for anything that adds too heavy. You just shut right. them down, and so they just go they pass turn. It, oh, it show hurts. Them the, sauce. the sauce hey. is the raw. Funny thing is, never drew it. It's <laughs> never, never drew it. It's good. Yeah, if you draw it, it's amazing. I just never drew it. I don't know if this card likes me or not. It, it got some. Like Probably so. You got your spirit on, on it, but <laughs> yeah, I hope y'all like my deck. It's pretty nutty. It's pretty cool. And um, like, if I had other cards, or better yet, had the deck already made and practiced with it, I feel like I would have did better. But no excuses. I went uh, X three and one tie against Pelio. I was kind of surprised how I got the tie with the Pelio. He 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 kept just going into his extra deck and wasting resources. And once I got my 3,000, dude, I, it was just already too late. You know what I mean? It was already, yeah. So he lost. And Twin Twist just came in clutch that turn, too. But yeah, appreciate it. Oh, for sure. Yo, thank y'all so much. God bless you. Make good choices. Don't hurt your brain cells. Stay tuned for future content. And uh, you're going to be hearing from us soon, but uh, it's really late. And it's time to go night-night. Peace out, y'all.